please. Hi, I'm in Portland to take a look at the first real WiMAX network that Clearwire has deployed. Okay, I'm going to show you the difference between the old world and the new world. What I have behind me here is the old world. This is the 2G, uh, 2G infrastructure. So this is the cellular infrastructure. There's this huge, great big thing here. And then you've got masses and masses of cables. These giant cables going up all the way up, uh, a, uh, up the tower here. And uh, the cables are so heavy for the cell phones that the tower and the 2G, the tower has to be reinforced. Now over here, we have the new world, which is WiMAX. And I'm going to show you, can we, we need to open up the cabinet here. Bear with me for a second. Come and open up the cabinet. And what we have here is, we have a really small little thing that is going to handle hundreds of times more traffic than that giant, uh, that giant setup you saw there. So if I could just show you here, this is a basically a WiMAX space station uh, live on the network in Portland, and it's just classic Ethernet really. You've got it's all digital, and so you have um, Ethernet going in and out to the WiMAX Mac and radio, broadcast all the way up the cell tower, and then the backhaul is microwave. So we don't need all these great big heavy cables. And this is the future of a wireless internet. Much, much, much more efficient, much, much faster. We're getting 14 megabits of performance uh, down and three megabits up driving around Portland, all using this modern equipment, unlike the old stuff. It's really, really good. I, I am in driving across Portland in a WiMAX connected car with uh, Ben Wolf and Scott Richardson from Clearwire and Tim and we are seeing the most amazing, amazing technology. We're getting uh, over 11 megabits down, three megabits up. We've been streaming high def video, which of course the driver is not allowed to look at. Four people synchronizing email and a crystal clear Skype call. Uh, this technology means that you can do stuff like, we can look ahead at webcams further down the route so we can physically see the traffic that's on the roads ahead of us. Obviously we can do all the office productivity stuff or your email or entertainment or we're getting perfectly great radio on all the internet radio stations and uh, and then you can use uh, Google Earth to see local businesses uh, touch the phone number on the PC and get a crystal clear Skype call to the business. All in all this is really really amazing stuff. So what we saw today was a remarkable demonstration of what will be going live all the way across the US and across a whole number of other countries in the next year, year and a half. Really amazing high speed wireless broadband that means you could do high definition video on devices or really high speed web access, upload, download, all of those kinds of things. It's the result of several years hard work by a lot of Intel folks and the good news is it's about to happen. Uh, all in all, uh, the next year and a half should be a fantastic time for the notebook computer uh, as these WiMAX networks begin to get deployed.